Minnesota Timberwolves trade for Monty Morris in exchange for Shake Milton, Troy Brown Jr. in the second round pick. So Monty Morris, it's a good addition for this Minnesota Timberwolf team. And I know Morris, he's barely played this season for the most part for the Pistons. And we know the Pistons, one of the worst teams in the league. And now this is the second deal they've made here today with the deadline being tomorrow. So in terms of fantasy basketball, I still don't think Monty Morris will carve out a big enough role. But as a backup guard for this Minnesota Timberwolf team, I think it's a good move. So on the year, 4.5 points a game. Two rebounds, 1.3 assists, and 36% from the field. So like I said, the Pistons, they've been making deals, getting rid of the veteran players, getting some second-round picks and younger players in deals. And for a guy like Monty Morris, who surprisingly barely played this season for this Piston team, they flip him and get Shake Milton in the second round, then Troy Brown. So Monty Morris, like I said, I don't think he'll play enough of a role to be a guy that's going to be a fantasy option Unless you're in the deepest of weeks and out of Shake Milton going to Detroit. We'll see if he sticks with the Pistons on the year. Only 4.7 points a game, 1.3 rebounds, 1.3 assists, and 40% from the field. So he was barely playing at all for the most part with Shake Milton. And we saw Milton a few seasons ago. He was good with the Philadelphia 76ers. But the last couple seasons, he's bounced around a little bit. And his playing time really hasn't been much at all here with Shake Milton. And out of Troy Brown Jr., He's barely seen the court this season with the Timberwolves. So maybe with the Pistons, he'll see the court since they're a young team and they're just trying to build around young guys and see what they have at the future is Detroit, obviously. With them being out of it very early in the season and Brown on the season and limited playing time, 4.2 points a game, 1.9 rebounds, and 44% from the field. So right now, really, this isn't a fantasy basketball type of deal, but it's a real-life move. I like it for the Timberwolves. I've mentioned in other videos that they need a guard to acquire and he's a nice backup guard to go behind Mike Conley now is Monty Morris we've seen him a lot in his career with <clears throat> we've seen Morris be a good part of the Denver Nuggets before he got dealt a couple seasons ago and now I think he could be a good piece off the bench for 15-20 minutes a game for this Minnesota Timberwolves so Monty Morris traded Minnesota Timberwolves and we'll see if he can help this Minnesota Timberwolf team as a nice guard off the bench that could come in 15-20 minutes and provide backup depth and a guy could make a difference shooting the three ball and assisting for the remainder of the 2024 season.